What's up guys, welcome back to the channel, to part 2 of the quarry. Let's get right into it. Peace and love. See you later, kids. Yeah, Hackett's Quarry forever. <laughs> you know how many hearts are broken on the last day of summer camp? It's like a romance apocalypse. They'll get over it. Yeah, well, I mean, they're just kids. You know, they'll get over it. Uh huh. Like they'll get over Emma. Ooh. That's not the same thing. Oh, so that's not why you're in a bad mood. I'm not in a bad... Oh my. <laughs> you know what? We had our last night together, and we're cool. Oh, yeah. So cool that you're never going to see your special little boo-boo bear ever again. Jeez, Chris, you heard that? Oh, come on, dude. The cabin walls are made of band-aids and rat turds. <laughs> okay, I get it. <laughs> okay, quit it. Hi, Emma. Hey. Okay, this is, um, you've heard of spatial awareness before, yeah. right? Spatial awareness is for nerds. Uh, be a lamb and grab the last couple of bags, will ya? Yes, boss. Say hi to Emma for me. You're a bad person. Yes, I am. Hey, what do you, uh, what are you listening to? Good to know. I ain't gonna cap, though. Kaylin kind of bad. Jake, bags, focus. Doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Not in the mood sign. Are you guys gonna help with the bags or what? Oh, um, you know, I was actually just working on fixing uh, the door. It's Dylan, come it's on. Broken. Dylan, please. I can't. It's, it's. I gotta get the last bags What's in there. Come wrong on. with this thing? It's just. Dylan, please. Sorry, bro. Cool. Thanks, guys. The two must be gay.
skill. <sighs> Bro, what? Ugh. Horror. I hate horror. Temperance. <sighs> Man, that's a bad place to get stuck. Yes, yeah, a freezer. bags great all by yourself huh yep guess you're gonna have to get used to that oh my god you are so mean <laughs> at least i'm honest oh okay here we go okay you're not telling me the whole truth about you and emma are you son playful oh okay so now i'm the one who's not telling the whole story huh <laughs> oh well this is the bait i just gotta take jake <laughs> bars Oh, sorry, I just got so distracted about that rhyme, I forgot what we oh, were... Oh, no, 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 uh, you, you were telling me how you totally have a thing for Ryan. Wait, are we talking about Ryan, the sailing instructor with the sexy brooding loner thing that totally doesn't do anything for me at all? Ooh, se sexy. Ah, oh, sexy, huh? How does that camp by far? Okay, sure. Uh, look, it was all settled by the girls in bunk seven, like, second day of camp. It goes Ryan... Me, of course. Then Dylan, Emma, Abby. Okay. Nick, and then Mr. H, and... Okay, are you almost finished? Please. Yep, that's it. That's everyone. Dang, Jacob, she said you bad. So she really just dumped her ass, huh? I don't... Okay. Her whole thing is like, how are we going to make this work? Different schools, blah, blah, blah. My whole thing is like, you know, maybe long distance, blah, 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 blah. And she was just like, Jacob... She gave you the look, huh? Yeah, do not pass go. Man, she has got you wrapped all the way around that dainty little finger of hers. How does she do it? Defeated. Okay, okay, you know what? Maybe you're right. Maybe she does have, like, this superpower over me. But you know what? Maybe I like it. <laughs> oh, likes it. Check. Totally not in denial. Oh, Check. Okay. Wow, the um the fumes of, of jealousy are just stifling over here. Excuse me? I'm just saying, I guess some girls don't have what it takes to hang with the big dog. You're a real charmer, you know that? Ooh. Confident. That's right. Because I could charm the pants off a snake. That's Maybe the dumbest thing you've ever said. No, no, I've definitely said dumber. Yep. Okay, so are we sure that this old rust bucket's roadworthy? <laughs> we'll take a look. It better be. One more night in the great outdoors might actually kill me. Hey, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Well, I haven't killed you yet. And you're still pretty pathetic. Hey, shut up. <clears throat> Uh, okay, so, um, total hypothetical, but if I was, like, a huge asshole and I wanted to break down the van so we'd have to spend another night here, uh, what exactly would I need to do? Well, you'd probably break the fuel line or 
I don't know, rip out the rotor arm? And yes, that would make you a total asshole. Okay, and what does a rotor arm look like again? It's like an arm that's all rotary. You know, it's under the little black dome with the leads poking out. Jake, you do realize that even if we somehow did get stuck out here, one more night with Emma wouldn't make a difference. Trust me, Chick's made up her mind. Yeah. Sure. Guess we'll just have to find out. <sighs> oh. Still the rotor arm. I don't want to break the fuel line. you right back tomorrow. No harm, no foul. Up here, my dudes. Why did they look like they're up to something? Hey, Jacob. What? No, dude, please. D -d 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 long. Oh, Nick! <laughs> Boom. Oh. oh. There it is. Oh, Ooh. man, good sight. Ooh. Freak. Oh. Ooh, I wish I had some singles. Ooh, freaks. I'm <clears throat> surrounded by freaks. <clears throat> oh, thank God. How I'm short is Caitlyn? Thing, but take me back, world. Caitlyn is small. Mr. Mr. H could have, like, charged up her phones, like, a little bit. Nothing's ever your fault, is it? <laughs> you know, you should really just save it for emergencies only. <laughs> Unless, of course, is being dumped <laughs> an emergency? <laughs> oh, bad. Friendly. Uh, okay, well, at least I had a relationship this summer. Ooh, damn, now we burn. Yeah, well, maybe not everyone is looking for a hook. Okay, 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 let's all put our little dicks wing uh, in the show, huh? Yeah, but hurts. Why, why would I know that? Mm -hmm. Sometimes you know stuff I don't. Look, I don't, I don't even know how to respond to that. You say, Nick, you're way smarter than me, and you're a super hot stud who gets any chick he wants. Okay, yeah, keep dreaming, Junior. She can draw. Hey there, party bear. Status report? We are officially empty nesters. High five up top. Oh boy. You're about to get your phone back, aren't you? Let's go collect our bags and away from this mosquito-infested backwoods dump. Doors locked, bags inside. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. Well, it's obvious what we have to do here. Find someone with a key? Shape our destiny. And by shape our destiny, I mean shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. Break in. Okay. Let's do it. We better not get into trouble. I won't tell if you won't tell. Mr. Hackett's gonna find out. So what? I'll just think it was a bear or something. Have you ever seen a bear in these woods? No, but that doesn't mean they're not out there. Fair point. All right, let's do this. On three. One. Two. Three! Ugh. Mm. All about the power of positive thinking. Why do I ever listen to you? Because I'm always right. Are you sure they're gonna think it was a bear? Oh, my God, relax. It's not like we killed someone. All right, well, I'm just gonna take another look around, make sure we didn't miss anything. Go nuts. Aw. This was little Izzy's. 
Ew. That's a little creepy. I wanna play a game. <laughs> Keep it. Let's get you back to Izzy. Path updated. Hmm. I can't believe I'm actually gonna miss all those lumpy loose springs. Oh, she kinda thick. Why would this place be in the news? Gotta do something with the with the ham scare him. Ooh, dang. It's gonna be weird not waking up to Dylan's morning announcement. is not going to be happy that the kids just left this year. <laughs> I'll tell Chris about it when we see him. Jacob hasn't seen this. I don't think anyone knocked Caitlin out of first place all summer. 
Kalen just too nice like that. Ready to roll? Yeah. Let's do it. Finally. Time to let loose and vamoose this caboose. How are you so dramatic? Annoying. Confident. It's just acting. It's what the people want. So you're faking it? I mean, in a way, faking it is just being yourself, but louder. You should try it sometime. You never know who you might impress. No, <laughs> it's too late now anyway. For what, you and Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. Jinkies. I'm dead. Okay, so hypothetically, if I were to put myself out there, what if he ends up being a dud? Kind of like you and Jacob. It's actually really sweet. Then why'd you quit it? Summer fling. We're going to school like four states away. I, he gets it. Yeah, sure. But that's us. You and Nick. Could be different. When you get his handle, hit him up. Oh, I already have his email. It was in the packet they gave to us on the first day. Email? Are you 93? What's wrong with email? I'm really gonna miss you, Abby. Oh, hold up! Oh, uh, but the lodge is that way. Go right here. Why? Come on, scenic route? One last victory lap around the camp? Scenic. Yes. Sure. What's the victory? Two months. No technology. I kind of thought it was nice to be offline. Ugh, I didn't. Plus, my subs need me. Oh, she do YouTube. Sarcastic. Oh, how'd they even get by for two months without you? I will have you know that I have a very loyal and engaged subscriber base. I provide very important and educational lifestyle advice in the form of entertaining and hilarious video monologues. They rely on me. Oh, totally. You're a big deal. Uh, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm sure they're gonna be like really happy or rock. <laughs> My favorite spot. The fire pit? The island. Mad secluded, right? Is... Is that smoke? Should we tell someone? Mm, it looks pretty contained. It's probably just Mr. H burning some stuff before, you know, he closes camp for the summer. Yeah. Speaking of which, we should... We should probably, you know, get back. Oh, yeah. Worried Nick's, you know... Gonna leave it at you? Well, no, they're probably like all waiting for us. Mm hmm. Everyone's waiting for us. Everyone, yeah. Nick, waiting for you. All, everyone, same. Ooh. Don't worry, Jacob, I got you. I got a full tank of gas, so. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, idiot. <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? Hey, there's no signal out here anyways, dude, okay? This place is like patchy as balls. <sighs> Your balls are patchy? What? No. <laughs> it's okay, I'll just go get some juice from Mr. H before we go. Uh, ew. <sighs> Hey, Nick. Hey, 
Where were you guys? Wouldn't you like to know? Ignore her, please. Let's go. Just gotta get these bags up onto the. Oh, hey, hey, here. Let me um, let me get a for you. I can take care of my own bag, thank you. What? Are you sure? Because I mean, it's really not that big. She of can deal. take care of her own. Calm bag, down, you simp. We can both take care of our own bag, thank you. Cool. Nice. Uh, uh, Abby, do you need? Yeah. Can I? Thank you. <laughs> hey, has anyone seen Ryan? Oh yeah, he's probably off being all brooding and mysterious and alluring somewhere. <laughs> I'm here. What were you doing under there? Having a little me party? Uh, I was listening to a podcast, actually. Oh, podcast. Nice, that's cool. What's it about? Yeah, what's it about? Is it about me? Sound kind of gay. I but... think I was listening to a podcast about you okay if anyone you had a podcast about them it'd be me yeah if there was a podcast called how to look and smell like a butt <laughs> oh my god you are so childish at least I don't look and smell like a butt no it's a, it's a paranormal podcast Th this episode was actually about this place weirdly enough the hag of hackett's quarry the who of the what's it where now what's the hag of hackett's quarry you don't know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, if I did, would I be asking them ass? Tell her about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, I don't think she wants to know about the Hag of Hackett's <laughs> oh, Quarry. Can we just please stop saying the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? It's just this campfire story for the kids. It's, um, there's supposedly an old woman who died in a fire a few years back. She haunts the woods looking for her lost baby boy. There are like reports of whispers or whatever, and, and this figure that floats around, you know, textbook ghost stuff. Some people say that if she catches you alone, she'll try to turn you into her son or kill you or something. I don't know. It's never really been clear. Anyways, Haga Haggett's Corey. You made that up. It's right here in the podcast, man. <laughs> cool story, bro. Supportive. Seriously though, you should have seen the first time he told the story to the kids at the campfire. They were scarred for life. I mean, not for <laughs> life. You gotta be careful with this stuff, man. This shit's true. Come on, dude, bullshit. What's the holdup, Hacketeers? Hey, uh, uh, nearly done, Mr. H. We're up to it. Get those butts in gear. Sorry, Mr. H. Yeah, to liberate some luggage. Shut up! Maybe if somebody didn't spend so much time trying to press the ladies' ball as ghost stories. You asked. Ghost stories? The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Oh! <sighs> hey, you still have the van key, Mr. H? Well, yes, I do. But you know, I'd lose my head if it wasn't stuck on. Back to the office I go. Give me a hand, would you, Ryan? Oh, okay. Yo, Mr. H. What's up, DJ Dylan? Any chance I could get a little charge? I want to have some uh, tunes for the road. No can do. No worries. Cool, cool, yeah. No worries. Good man. Uh... No big deal, you can share my earbuds. Dylan kinda zesty.
So, uh, Chris, I I'm actually glad we got a moment to talk. Uh, uh-oh. I'm not fired, am I? <laughs> no, no, it's, um, it's just, you know, about the whole thing w with the... Hold that thought, partner. I'm gonna have to take this. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, sorry. Hello? Yeah. Either listen to the podcast or eavesdrop. I'm gonna listen to the podcast because I can listen about what they talk about on the count. Sorry about that, bud. Sorry about that, bud. Didn't mean to push you out like that. No, it's cool. Phone call probably important. Dang, I should have eavesdrop. Let's go. E uh, you need a hand? Looking for the keys? Uh, no, end of summer. Busy, busy. You know. Anyway, you were asking me. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, it was just the whole animation school thing, what you thought I should do. Right. Y you know, listen, whether or not I should, like, leave my sister with my grandparents, since I'd have to live on campus, you know, and my mom's not exactly around, so I wouldn't want to leave Sarah on her own. You know, fam our family's small enough as it is. Well, family is important, Ryan. Dang it. Ryan do look frustrated, but I'm put concerned. Is everything okay? You got a hot day tonight? Oh boy. If you only knew. <laughs> so, uh, what, what did you need me for? You're one of my favorite counselors, Ryan. You know that. One of the good ones. But, do you know how many calls I get from parents, letter after letter, with these terrified kids that they send home? Huh. I, I didn't realize that. Believe it or not, scaring kids away from sleepaway camp is kind of bad for business. So, maybe just ease up on the ghost stories? Sorry, I didn't realize it was such a big deal. Gotta understand the repercussions of your actions, Buster. It's a big part of being a counselor, a leader. Yeah. Just stick to Kumbaya next time, okay? What's that? What? You don't you know what don't Kumbaya, do Kumbaya is? Kumbaya anymore? Good grief. I'm outgrowing my own cliches. Seriously, Chris, what's going on? I just want to get you guys safely out of Dodge before the sun goes down. Why? You know why. Why? It's getting dark, Ryan, and it's not safe to drive in the dark. And safety is the first step towards fun. That was a weird answer. <laughs> just give me a minute. Good goddamn, are they? Will you say goodbye to Caleb and Kaylee for me? They sort of just snuck off. Well, you'll see him again next year. Caleb works at the scrapyard during the off season, and Kaylee, well, she's still figuring out what she wants to do. She's got her whole life ahead of her. They both just come and go as they please, really. Teenagers, am I right? Actually, could have used the help packing up since we were short staffed. Hey, you guys seem to manage all right. But I'll tell them both you were sad you missed them. Unlocked the van, put
Put the keys in my pocket. Came in the office. Right where I left uh -huh. it. Uh-huh. Let's skedaddle. There's more is definitely something going on. At night time. Make sure they're all ready to sure they're all ready to go. For real this time. Wait, how did you get your phone back before the rest of us? I never turned it in. You should have turned it off before you handed it in, Dylan. Them's the rules, you noob. Dang. He just got caught a noob by an old man. I try not to dwell on the past, man. Good. Because it's time to dwell on the minivan. Get on with our respective lives. Move it. Let's go. What's the problem? Ugh, dude, I don't know. I, I think there's something wrong with the engine, Mr. H. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah, dude, it's just like kaput. All right, let me try. What, dude, I'm telling you, all right, it's busted. Well, maybe you're doing Go, it wrong. Well, maybe you're doing it wrong. What the fuck, dude? Enough, enough, both of you. Shit, come on, all right, come dude, on. Chill, chill, dude. I'm told you kids to check everything. No, we did. It, it should be working. Yeah, well, coulda and shoulda doesn't mean it is, does it? Damn it! Okay. Okay. Well, uh, look, it's not that big of a deal, okay? We'll just spend one more night here. No! No! Just stop. Let me think. Dang. Okay. Damn it. You're right. You're right. Yeah. What? Yeah, you're right. Odell. Hey, Brian. Come here for a sec. Make sure that everybody is inside the lodge for tonight. Lock the doors. No one in, no one out. No one. Got it? Okay. I'll be back first thing in the morning. And we'll get you all on the road. You just have to keep everyone inside. Can you promise me you'll do that? Compliant. Yeah, sure. We'll, we'll stay inside. And a boy. Lock the doors. And for God's sake, keep the noise down. So, what was that about? Yeah. Uh, said to stay inside that we're not leaving until the morning are you kidding me um are you kidding me jacob what is are we weird to do? well we should like, go inside like he said we could go inside like emma until don't morning. you yeah or or we could do something else Insisting. No, 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 no. We should really listen to what Chris told us to do. Of course. Uh, who cares yeah, what tired. Chris told us to do? He's not our boss anymore. P A R T. Why the fuck not? All right, it seems like the stars have aligned for us, no? Okay, okay, okay. One last epic bonfire blowout for all time.
Oh, dude. Fuck yes, I'm in, Nick. You're in. Yeah, I'm in. Dylan's in, obviously. My man. Caitlin? I go where my people need me. Yeah, okay. Em, what do you say? Mm. <laughs> yeah, I'm in. Mr. Hackett seemed pretty insistent we stay in the lodge. He was just trying to freak us out, you know? Like, um... Like one of Ryan's stupid ghost stories. Why would he want to scare us? Supportive. I'm sure he's just looking out for us. No big deal. All right, yeah. No, Party. I, I didn't mean. High five. Touch my hand, Ryan. Reluctant. Fine. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I just want to go on record and say that this is a bad oh idea. God, dude. Ugh. Ugh. It's gonna be fine, man. Trust me. It's gonna be chill. All right. All right. All right. Hacketeers. Party planning committee. Let's do this. Um. Okay. First things first. Nick and Abby. You go get some firewood. Uh, Emma and I will go to the stores for some supplies. And uh, Dylan, you just, I don't know, figure out how to charge the phones or something. All right, let's do this. They getting hunted. What does that say? Hunting season. I was hoping you'd come back to me. Let's see what you found. Temperance. <laughs> to be balanced. To consume in moderation. Or to indulge in excess. Temperance. Take it or leave it. But remember, sometimes, with temperance comes deferred gratification. There's more I can show you, if you like. Of course. I was hoping you'd say that. Ooh. You'd better be going. It's still early and the moon is bright, but time won't wait. Not for those with a story to tell. Be careful. Look out for yourselves. And look out for my cards. Bar, guys. I'm in the here. I hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe for the next part.